This is a short video to show you how to put data into your TI-83. Uh, it should also work for TI-84. So I've got data here uh, for tornadoes recorded per month. So you'll notice that I've got 12 um, numbers listed. And so what I want to do is go in and put that into and store it into my calculator as a variable. So what you're going to want to do is start by pushing your stat button. So I just pressed on that. And you're already automatically on the edit. So you'll notice that this is highlighted. So you're going to enter when you have that cursor over that. So I'm going to push enter, which is at the bottom. And then you'll notice that you've got these things called L1, L2, L3. So each of these columns are a separate variable. And so they're all empty right now. So I'm going to pick one of them. And I'm going to just start with L1. And you'll want to remember what it's called because later you're, you're going to want to co um, compute statistics on it. And at that point, you start entering your data. So I'm going to put in a 10, enter, 18, 26, 33, and then just continue on down your list. So after you type in each one, you'll want to enter. And if you're clumsy like me, you'll want to also go back and double check. So we will do that once I put all of them in. 133, 138, 150, and 316. All right. So you can use your little arrow cursor keys up here to page back up. So 316, 150, 138, 133, 32, 124, 123, 32, 26, 18, and 10. So that all looks good. And now to get out of the screen, so first make sure you remember this is L1. So we'll come back in on another video and calculate some statistics. But to get back to your main screen, you want to quit. So you'll have to use your second key to get access to this command here. So let's let all those things that are above your keys in yellow are. So I'm going to hit second and then this button that has quit above it and it takes me back to the main screen. So you've now got data in there.